Hey yo together and very welcome to Starcraft 2 Legacy of the Void campaign playthrough! You're in the solar core and it looks like we have some things to check here, so let's start. Oh, we get the solar lands. Uh, strafes the target area with powerful laser beams. Fire three beams dealing 200 damage with each beam. Okay. I think that's cool. Or we get the warp in reinforcements. Quickly warps in a pylon with two melee warriors and two ranged warriors to any visible location. So yeah, let's see. Look here, Hierarch. <coughs> this material self-regenerates. It is no wonder the research of the Terrans claimed it to be from a recent epoch. My projections place it at several billion years old, if not more. Zeratul's vision said that this keystone can guide us unto hope. What do you think it means? Yes, guide us. It is a code wanting to be cracked. The keystone seems to be able to manipulate energies, but that may not be its sole purpose. I believe it stores its origin point within. Its origin point? Yes, I promise you. I will find out how this will lead us to the Zelnaga. Redouble your efforts, Karax. There is little time. Poor little Karax. I think he has to do some overdue? Or is it called like that? Or extra shifts? Robotic and so bad at can now be added to our army hierarch. I return to serve. Okay, we can get the barrier. Uh, 100 damage. That's not too much. Oh, okay. I will go up to 200, I think. I do or we can get the annihilator with the shadow cannon. Oh, look at that, I can shoot 200 damage to target unit or structure. I, huh, I will think. Serve. I think I will stick with the immortal first. But let's see what's there. Uh, hey there, your royal ness. Man, this is weird. I've never talked to no Protoss before. <laughs> hey. If I have learned one thing from your commander, Raynor, it is that we are not so different, Rory Swan. Continue your report. Right. So, the artifact, uh, the, uh, the keystone thingy's all yours. We're in the middle of transmitting all our data to your engineer. You have my thanks. Please relay my appreciation to Commander Raynor. Hey, you got it, Skippy. Skippy? <laughs> well, yep. That's your nickname now. Ooh. Okay. Uh, it looks like we have to go to a new world. Zeratul, old friend. I have the keystone you believed would lead to our salvation. And yet, faith alone will not defeat Amon. As Hierarch, I was made aware of a location where our Kalai scientists experimented on new weaponry in secret. Within the Glacius facility, the Purifier program has been reborn. We must recover this immensely powerful technology. The Nerezim of Shakuras ritually sever their connection to the Kala. Because of this, they are now the last free Protoss. I must reach them before Amon's armies. Hmm. Okay, so... Huh, that's, that's difficult now. And I don't know what to choose here. But I think I will go to Shakuras first. I guess? Yeah, I think so. I mean, the sentry is nice, but the Dark Templar could be way better. of life is extensive. Hold. We are receiving a transmission. Praise the gods. 
Artemis, you live. Matriarch Vorazun, what has happened here? Shakuras has fallen. The warp gate linking this world to Ayer has been reopened. Countless hybrid and Zerg pour from the other side. They've obliterated our cities, decimated our Shadow Guard. We are trying to evacuate the remaining population, but I am uncertain whether we can hold long enough to get them safely away. We will give you the time you need, Matriarch. My Templar are inbound. Okay. My Dark Templar were tracking your invasion on Ayr when we were cut off. Then the warp gate opened. What happened, Artanis? Amon used the Kala to seize control of the Templar. I could feel his rage tearing through me, and I was powerless against it. Zeratul found me. It was there that he... He... Yes? He tried to free me. And he succeeded at the cost of his own life. He fell by my hand. It was Amon's deed, not yours. Zeratul came to me with a warning, but I did not act. Because of this, he is now gone, and the stars burn dimmer for his loss. Amon's deed or not, I carry a burden, Matriarch. One that cannot be easily lifted. True, true. So let's see that. All this time, this wretched little world was within striking distance of our fleets. Much has changed since your era, Preserver. First you consort with those Herons, and now the Fallen Ones? It is heresy. You must know this. The Dark Templar are now our allies. There was a time when the Protoss were broken. Throughout the Aeon of Strife, we tore at each other with wanton abandon. Only one path was ever found to end the madness and unify our people. The Kala. The Dark Ones rejected its light. They denied their own race. How can you fight for them? For one so sworn to preserve our history, Rohana, how can you be so blind to its turn? I... I see I have offended you, Hierarch. My apologies. Adapting to this period is... difficult. Yeah, I think so too. I've been trying to isolate the major population centers in need of evacuation. The Zerg signatures far outnumber those of the Protoss, but most of the survivors seem to have gathered within Talametros. There must be Nerezim Phasemiths you know among them, those who stayed behind. I am not seeing any Protoss life signs from within the engineering base, Hierarch. Then they have met their fate. Or perhaps they fought their way to safety. The Dark Templar do not follow our caste system. Some of their faith smiths are trained warriors, skilled as any of ours. That does give them an advantage I had not realized. But then, our people are very different. Of course, Hierarch. Uh, yeah, well... I would say let's start a mission then, come on. The Zerg infestation is overtaking Talametros. Our evacuation is already in great peril. Your aid cannot come soon enough, Hierarch. Okay, right. we get our Templar, Solarite, and more Solarite. Okay, uh, wait a second, I think. I think I will go. Ah, Hierarch. In Welcome to the Solar Core. In that yeah, thank you. I, I think I will go with the Solar Lands in that mission. What conduit? Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's let's go with that. I really like the reinforcements, but in that mission, I mean, I get Dark Templar now, so. I think I will need those, if I remember right, I will need those to yeah, press forward, free a lot of stuff somehow, uh, liberate those guys. And uh, then with the solar lens I can kill the detection more easily. I could also use the 
uh, the stasis field uh, to lock the detection down for 20 seconds, but I think killing it is more beneficial to me. Shakura's teams with Amon's Zerg broods. We hold only the southwest quadrant of Ptolemetros, and even that is in peril. We must evacuate our people, but the launch bays have been defiled with infestation. Only ground forces can clear them. Once the bays are free, the planetary warp conduit will allow our ships to escape safely. The launch bays will be cleared. Your people will survive, Matriarch. This I swear. Okay. You will need the so aid of my Dark Templar in this battle. They can strike from the shadows without fear of reprisal. What would you ask of us? So there is no detection I now. But a At least I don't see any. So Cut let's see. Two. Clever. Okay. These vaults hold the solar right reserves that power Ptolemetros. You may claim them with our blessing, Hierarch. Artanis, I'm detecting a rift opening near your position. Avoid Thrasher. By the oh. gods, it's sieging the warp conduit. Warriors, we must slay it before it destroys the conduit. Strike as one Templar. Okay, maybe I opened that one too fast. The darkness from the shadows. Oh yeah, I need to be careful here because this guy can deal heavy damage. So let's see. The Thrasher is slain. Okay. But it will be for naught if the launch bays remain infested. I will be careful. The spore crawlers and overseers ahead can detect our Dark Templar's movements. Slay them first. Oh, come on! Boss, the boss. Exactly the case why, why I went for the solar lands. I really wonder if I killed that. No. Okay, the queen is not spitting on my Templar. That's that's nice. So this will take some time. Fine again. Would love to have Matriarch Horizon. The first launch bay has been cleared. Continue evacuating. Come on. What would you ask of us? Wait a second. Oh no, is that a shore up our defenses? The Zerg are moving to attack our nexus point. I am but a phantom. So I think that's fine. I don't know if I can make everything with the... Oh, what's that? Never seen transport of him. If I can do anything with the Dark Temple, I know. But for now it's looking okay, I would say. I mean, I just need to make sure I don't die to the... Wait a second. Should I? Maybe I should... Do it like that. So you killed that. And now I should be... Oh, I lost one. Okay. So I killed that one. Um, so that's looking good. Oh, what's that? A new void. The conduit Russia. is under assault. Ooh, whoa, 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 whoa. Clever. Okay. So I need to be very careful about that. Because of those side storm things, exactly. So 
so kill the Midas. So the damage seems to be good. The has been eliminated. This would be an opportune moment to clear the launch base. Yeah, I'm on it. I might wanna try to get a uh, Nexus up there. This could be helpful later on. So I will try that. I just need to make sure that I don't have any detection there. So, I mean, if I have detection, it's not a big problem. If my opponent has detection, that's when it gets uh, problematic. So I need to make sure that they don't have any detection. Why did I not collect that gas thing there? That's a bit strange. I am here in the shadows. I am here in the shadows. So, uh, I think... Oh! Not good! But I can't... Oh, I should maybe wait. Maybe there's a spore I can kill as well. So, yeah. Okay, so... I will get a pilot here. And... Get... Two more. Yeah, I need to be very careful. So I think that's looking good. I am with you. The darkness rides. Let our enemy know our fury. Yeah, that's that's okay. We have secured a second launch bay. Well done. Half of the bays are launching evacuation ships. Okay. I am we So yeah, come on. For now it's looking good, I would say. I mean, I'm clearing a lot of stuff here. And it's still okay. Let's say that's okay, we cover solo right time. stuff. Ah, okay, I see. We are one with the shadow. You seek our servant. The darkness rides. Okay, now what? Screw that. Okay, uh, let's get a nexus here. Oh, I totally forgot about that. So one more here. I can move in some of the teams. Okay. What would you have? I am Jungle. State that you require my skills. Yeah, some Vespin gas. I mean, I don't know what I should do with all the Vespin gas, but I will find out for sure. So there's one too much, but I can. Get some pilots here. And possibly warp in some more stalker. Come on! So let's see, I need one more of those Solarite reserves. And then. Ooh! Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay. No, 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 I failed quite a bit here, so the solar lens is not ready yet. Come on! Ah. Oh, he just did slow them. Um, I do know in Brute War, this slime thing from the Queen did reveal cloaked units, no? I thought so. Um, if I'm wrong, please tell me, but... I think, I mean on Brutal, you could have enabled that, because it's Brutal difficulty, but currently it's just uh, easy going, you know. 
it's really easy goes here. I mean fear is an illusion. Okay. Let's have a look here. Cold is the void. What would you ask of us? Ha! Okay. Oh, a white flash right to my face, that's bad. Um, yeah, let's do it like that, like that, and like that. Okay, that was... Another thrasher felled. Is there no end to these abominations? No, there's no end. Steve, what would you ask of us? You require my skills. Okay, there's Vespin gas. There's Vespin. I don't know why I need that much Vespin gas, but... I guess there is a reason. I am intrigued. Uh, what do I do now? I, ah, that's a good, that's good. Blink and kill that one. So that our Templar can move in. Yeah, I think I sh can just overwhelm those. Guys. Screw it. You're dead. We have purged the infestation. Only one launch bay remains disabled. But I need to find one more uh, stupid thing before. Wow! That's a bit harsh. Going that hard after me. Uh, did I not queue those up? Apparently not. Okay, so let's see. Okay. Okay, there is the observer. I like I like that, how that the shape of that. That was awesome. Ah, there it is! Look at that! Woo! Okay, so with that, I just need to recover the last more. Solarite reserve now. The solar Look at the overmans I got. By the time our forces return, Hierarch. What's going on here? I need seven more, so that's ten, nine, eight, seven. Okay. Why is that so easy? I guess it's because we are still at the beginning of the campaign, but oh. What? Yeah, I don't know. So let's produce some pilots and then let's, let's have a look here. Yeah, looks okay. Okay, where do I have to go? If I would know that, I mean, I need to go there, but there's... where's the way? Oh, up the, that ramp, okay. Oh, I need to kill that Void Thrasher. Artanis, another Void Thrasher has been summoned. This one is in the heart of the city. Yeah... I will be fine. No! But I really think I can just press forward and kill everything with fire. I mean, yeah, I'm losing quite a lot here, but seriously, who cares? I mean, what else could go wrong right now? I got the Dark Templar, I got the Stalker. That's completely fine. You require my skills. Intriguing. But I oh, I should not move into that storm. Or in those storms. But guess what? Easy going. Kill it, kill well it done, fire. brave warriors. Amon's thrashers are no match for the Templar. Thank you, GG, no re easy going. Yeah, come just kill this constriction thingy and then that's it. 
Got it. Matriarch, you may complete the evacuation. You have saved my people, Artemis, and they will never forget it. Yep, I did. And now we got Dark Templar. That's good. And some more Solarite. Woo! Solarite hype. Solarite hype. Despite this tragedy, I am pleased to see you once more, Hierarch. I had hoped that our next interaction would be your announcement of Ayer's reclamation. As did I. Instead, the Templar have fallen. Then the threat is greater than I realized. We cannot let the same fate befall Shakuras. It is too late for that. Amon Zerg poured through the warp gate as a tide of flesh and blade. They have already overrun Telemetros and are nearing the shrines of Lazul. This world is lost. With such an infestation, Shakuras must be destroyed. Destroy Shakuras? I will not permit this. Permit? Shakuras was my people's home long before we offered your sanctuary upon it. I will not let this world be a den for Amon's forces. Worlds may fall to ash. What matters is that we endure. To lose Shakuras and Aya. We are a vagabond people, Artanis. Our true home has always been Aya. Let us reclaim it together. It is fitting that the daughter of Raja Gaul decides the fate of the world she helped forge. Let us make preparations at once. Okay, so you just want to blow up the entire planet soon. Hierarch, huh? I have powered up a new ship subsystem. You can review it in the solar core now. No, not now, because that's the end of this episode. Bam! So. Uh, I guess we got one more mission on Shakuras. I will play this the next time. So, yeah, thank you for watching. As always, I hope you enjoyed, and I wish you a very nice day, and goodbye.